Hey, 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 it's your boy Jalen aka Lick My Fashion I am back with another video, we love it. I got the juice, I got the, I got the sauce, Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. I got the juice, I got the So you guys already know what time it is. Before we get into this video, I would like you guys to subscribe to my channel, youtube.com slash lick my fashion. Ay, get it, get it, whoa, ay, get it, get it. Ay. Make sure to give this video a big, big thumbs up, guys. Don't forget to smash, I said, don't forget to smash the like button before I smash no fierce. Hello. And again, guys, don't forget to follow me on my social media. It'll be in the description box below. It will pop up on the screen. What, what, where it at though? Where it at though? We are it at. Do a weird day. Before we get into this video, I'd like to just say Merry Christmas. Oh my gosh. I hope you guys had an amazing Christmas and I hope you guys enjoyed everything you got and you know just celebrating the Lord. It's always good to see, you know, family celebrate with family. Shout out to y'all. But anyways, what better way, okay, to end off 2018 with a banger. As you guys see by the title below, we're gonna be doing trends that we're ditching in 2019. I'm just gonna throw all these trends away because I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it happening. I don't want to see it at all. So without further ado, let's get into the video, shall we? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, Billy Brock. Are you doing? I'm gonna are you So the first thing that has to go is colorful wigs. Uh, no, I'm tired. No, I'm tired. Uh, no, everybody's taking I'm tired. No, I'm done. I'm done. First six nine did it, then all of a sudden all these girls did it. That trend needs to go. I'm tired of y'all looking like rainbow skittles. I only want to see another package. I don't want to see another hair. Over it. Y'all be looking like Starburst, okay? I'm I'm just tired. It was already done when it was on six nine. It just looks even dumber now that it's a trend. I'm over it. I am over it. It's okay to do colorful wigs in terms of like one standard color. So if I see like one pink, okay, cool. If I see a neon green, okay, cool. Like I like that. But when you're trying to do a rainbow head top looking like Starburst, looking like Skittles, I'm uh, baby girl, <laughs> baby girl, listen, be some old voice, heads up, don't shoot, <laughs> stop doing the colorful wigs. The next trend that we must ditch in 2019 is designer head to toe. Honestly, truly and iconically, I don't get it. I don't think people understand that fashion is not designer and designer is not fashion. You look tacky, you look dusty, you look busted up. Great, you spent $2,000 on your outfit, but you don't look $2,000 worthy of fashion, okay? okay. You spent $2,000 and you still look dusty over it. Everybody has been doing it in 2018 where like they feel like they can wear designer from head to toe in every outfit and it looks tacky. Like you're wearing a Gucci headband, then you got a Versace pair of pants, then you got a Versace top, then like, and then you got some, some Gucci shoes. Like you yeah, just look dusty, okay? Listen, I don't care if you spend $2,000, I don't care if you spend $4,000, I don't care if you spend $8,000. You look dusty. You need to go home. Change, okay? Get Zara, for instance. You'll look probably better. Let's just keep it to a minimum, okay? Like, do a Versace shirt, then have some nice pants, then have some nice heels, then have, you know what I mean? Or or if you're a man, you know, have a headband, have a dress. Like, just just do something very minimal. But we don't need to see Versace this time, Versace build time, Versace head time, Versace, like, no. You look tacky, you look dumb, you look busted, okay? So, no, we're over it. Next. The next trend that we're ditching in 2019 is those damn listen i'm gonna talk about this <laughs> those damn fila clunky body high top speed water dumb dusty beat up big car boat looking fila shoes got to go no i'm honestly tired I, I don't like those shoes i don't get it personally i don't like anything that looks clunky i don't like clunky filas clunky yeezys girls are out here wearing a size 5 fila shoe having their foot looking like a size 10 i don't like those big clunky clunky shoes i think they're tacky they don't look good in my opinion but hey everyone has their own opinion but i said what i said and i meant what i said i don't like those shoes period honestly just throw the whole shoe away let's just throw the high water 2018 escalade shoe away i don't like the trend never liked it i always thought it was dumb and i'm over it so if you guys don't agree with me or if you guys disagree <laughs> i said what i said and i meant what i said next the next trend that we're ditching in 2019 and i might get some backlash for this but honestly fake bodies when can we start appreciating our real bodies again listen there's a difference between you wanting to get your body done because you really feel like within your heart that you need to get it done like you really feel self-conscious and then there's another thing where like you're getting your body done because everyone else is doing it and i feel like that became a trend like one person got their body done then just multiple people got their bodies done and it was like when are we gonna go back to appreciating real beauty when are we gonna go back to just appreciating stretch marks when are we gonna go back to appreciating regular bums that just needs to be ditched i'm over it i'm tired and a lot of people will 
say, oh, like, you know, if I want to get my body done, then um, it's up to me that I can get my body done. But let's not go there with the fact that you thought, okay, you were definitely inspired by this industry. A lot of these people were inspired by this industry, and that's when I have a problem. That's fake and I'm tired, okay? No, we need to stop. Let's start appreciating real bodies. Let's start appreciating real bums. If you have a small bum, okay, work that. If you have small boobs, okay, work that, okay? Someone is going to appreciate you for who you are, okay? But I'm tired of y'all getting your bodies done. 2019, we cannot be doing this, okay? Next. So the next thing that we need to ditch in 2019, can we stop, like, using other people's pages for views? We're never going to enjoy the real content again. Seriously. All I'm seeing now that pops up on my recommendation feed is drama. Drama about other YouTubers, drama about this, drama about that. Like, when are we going to start using our page for us in general? Like, I feel like if you are a drama page out there, no disrespect, like, that's how you make your coin. We need to stop using other people's dramas for views. I don't get how people talk about somebody on a regular and feel no way about that. Like, your whole channel is based on drama. Talking about other people. That is it right with you? It's sad enough that when you build your page on just like drama, that's all everyone wants to see now. So now if you even try to do something different, you're not even getting your views. Let's stop that in 2019. We don't need to be doing that. Focus on yourself. Focus on your own views, okay? And focus on figuring out a way how you can deal with that on your own instead of looking at other people for drama. Okay, next. The next trend that we need to ditch is the term flued out. Honestly, y'all just make anything a trend, huh? It's like one person says something and then y'all just make it a whole trend. Listen, I don't want to hear flued out in 2019. Don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear flued out, okay? No, I just want to hear flown. And I get that she probably thought that that was a term, but you guys literally made it into a trend. Can we please not do the uneducational sayings in 2019, please? That's just not, like, it's not, it's not cute. Um, bad grammar, no, it's not a thing. It will never be a thing. Flued out? Flued out. Forget flued out. I'm tired, okay? I'm tired. Flown or fly, that's it. Not flued out, okay? Next. So the next trend that we're ditching in 2019 is definitely these, I don't even know what these are. I'm gonna put it on the side of the screen right now. These bulletproof chess looking, I don't even know what these are, like a chess rig or when I looked online, it was like a chess rig, but I've been seeing that everywhere. I don't like it. They look dumb. They're not fashion for it. So like, please, we need to stop wearing that. What is the purpose of that trend? Don't understand it don't like it. I feel like personally people who wear that, it ruins your outfit. So stop wearing that damn bulletproof chest rig. I don't like it. I don't like it for a fashion trend. I don't like it, period. Let's just cut it out because I'm tired. Okay, next. The next trend that we're ditching in 2019 is definitely black fishing. No, no, I'm tired. No, I'm tired. I'm tired. That black fishing thing really irks me. Girls who are trying to portray themselves as black, let's just cut it out. Like, hey, we're not, we're not going to do this. Like, we're not doing this. I don't want to see you guys trying to portray yourself as being black. I don't want you guys to put different makeup on like you're black. No. Be yourselves, okay? Be yourselves. Because what we're not going to do is you're not going to make money off of being black. We're not doing that. We're not going to make money off of trying to be black. We're not doing that either. When we're black on our own, we seem to always have to struggle. But then when you guys want to come in here and do whatever you want to your face to make yourselves look black, you guys are getting paid. So guess what? Nail. Cut it out. We're not out here posing as different races and getting paid for that. No, we're not doing that. Black fishing, black face, that needs to just go. I don't want to see it in 2019. I just want to see it, period. I don't want to see that stuff at all, okay? No, 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 no. And if I see it from any of you guys, you guys will be called out. I said what I said. Boop, next. Caking your face with makeup. Ladies, ladies, ladies. It's not that serious. You do not need that much makeup on your face. Seriously. I'm seeing girls in videos take the foundation and just squirt, okay? Y'all be literally taking the foundation, okay? Squirt and squirt and squirt and squirt. This is what y'all be doing. Y'all be doing this, okay? Y'all just keep continuing to go. And you're still going. And I'm like, okay, is this girl done now with the foundation? Nope, she's still going. Nope, she's still going. We're still going. Oh, and you're putting on more foundation. Okay, cool. So we're still going. And the girl is still taking more foundation and still going. No, because I want to know, like, what are you trying to do? Enhance your beauty? Or are you trying to look like a whole different human being? This is how some of y'all be looking with foundation on. And then you wonder why people tell you that you're a catfish. Why do we have pounds of makeup on and why do we look like this? If you're going to put makeup on, at least blend it. Let's just throw the whole putting pounds of makeup on our face and let's just do something different, okay? Because it's getting tired and I'm done. Everybody's speaking, I'm tired. Next. The next trend that we need to really ditch in 2019 is we need to stop praising celebrities like they're Jesus. No, I'm tired. Y'all need to stop praising these celebrities like they're Jesus, okay? There's only one Jesus and he is up here. It's very disturbing. It's annoying. The amount of work that you guys put in to be noticed by these celebrities is the same amount of work you can put in to do your business. The time that you're spending on these celebrities is the time that you should be spending on yourself. I don't get it. A lot of people, like, they be really defending these celebrities and they don't know them. Damn, like, y'all are really going hard for people that you don't even know. Some of y'all don't even go this hard for your own people. 
it's ridiculous that needs to stop we need to stop really treating these people like we know them we don't know them they don't know us we need to not do this in 2019 i'm tired i don't see nobody worshiping a celebrity like their god because no it's just getting out of hand and you just look dusty i'm tired so no we're not doing this no next so the next thing that we need to dash right okay in 2019 is definitely those damn gucci belts there are these gucci belts that these girls wear i guess to snatch their waist or whatever it is those gucci belts gotta go i'm tired i find that so many girls have them and worn them out it just looks tacky let's just throw the whole belt away okay let's just throw the whole belt away because what we're not gonna do is we're not gonna use it as a waist trainer we're not gonna use it as a waist belt no because that's what you guys use it as and i'm tired it's just so tacky you guys wear it over a freaking blazer you guys wear it over a dress you guys wear it over like i am just not with it like i'm just not with it no, we need to stop. No, we need to stop. It's it's done. It's a wrap. Okay, we're not we're not doing this anymore. We're not doing this. Okay, we're not doing this. Next. The next thing that we need to really just cut off is definitely those damn army pants. Yo, you see these pants right here? No, you guys need to cut it out. No, seriously, we need to cut it out. These orange pants. I'm tired of seeing it. I'm tired of seeing them in colors. It just looks tacky. It's not a fashion trend. It's just tacky. Every time I see people wear those, I'm like, seriously? Seriously, the only army that should be accepted is the regular green brown and black one Okay, those are the only army ones that I should see but like no I don't want to see the orange ones don't want to see the white don't want to see the red No, it just looks like a knockoff of the green It's supposed to be green black and brown and that's how it's supposed to be so guys remove the rest of the colors We're not doing the rainbow colors like we're not doing the rainbow wigs. We're not doing that. Let's throw it all away Okay next the next trend that we're ditching in 2019 is definitely when people say no cap seriously I'm tired of hearing that no cap what does that even mean? No, how about I bust a cap in your face? How about that? Because I don't get it. Oh, you already done. No, I'm gonna fight you. No cap. Oh, I'm gonna ding, 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 no cap. Oh, I'm gonna have ding, 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 no cap. How about you shut up with a cap? Throw that trend away. Let's just throw that whole trend away because it's annoying. I don't like hearing that. It's dumb. I don't wanna hear it. There's just things that we shouldn't bring in 2019, and that is definitely one of them. I don't wanna hear it. No cap, this, this, cap, with cap, without cap, body hole, cap, body crease, cap. Don't wanna hear anything about cap, 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 okay? So let's just leave that in 2018 and call it a day. <laughs> don't wanna hear no cap. <laughs> I don't wanna hear that. Period. <laughs> Next. And the last thing I'm gonna talk about is definitely, I think we should stop trying to be friends for clout. This is why social media pisses me off just a little bit because you're followers determine your friends if i had 100k followers like everyone wants to be my friend but if i had like 5k followers no one wants to be my friend why and it's always the one with the least followers who are the more genuine ones it's crazy so guys please if we're gonna be friends with somebody be genuine with them be honest be loyal just really do that because listen like you're really hurting people's lives when you just want to be friends with somebody who has clout like you want to be attached to somebody because they're famous or you want to be attached to somebody because they have a lot of followers that's just whack we need to cut that out too we need to cut out the begging for followers we need to cut out hanging around with people just to get followers we need to cut it out like we need to go back to the original way that we were being genuine with people listen the ones that you may think that have the least followers end up being the most genuine so just take it in for that it doesn't make sense hanging out with with somebody who has multiple followers who has a bunch of clout and they're trash no it doesn't make sense let's just be friends because we like them not friends because they have clout okay but all right guys so that concludes my trends that we're ditching in 2019 okay i'm tired don't want to see this like i'm over it like i don't want to see it at all like it's just all these got to go i hope you guys enjoyed this video okay make sure you guys subscribe to my channel youtube.com slash my fashion hey get it get it whoa hey get it get it Make sure to give this video a big, big thumbs up. Don't forget to, I said, don't forget to smash that like button for me. Smash on a fierce hello. And again, guys, make sure you guys follow me on my social media. It'll be in the description box below and it will pop up on the screen. What, what, where that though? Where that though? We are it at Dua. Where that? Comment and let me know which ones you guys agree with, which ones you guys disagree with, like all that, because honestly, I'm tired. Like, I'm over it. I don't want to see this. You already know what time it is. It is your boy Jalen, aka signing out. Peace. I love it when you whine on it. I love it when you cry. I love it when you tell your girlfriends that a young nigga beg for it. Girl, why lie? I? Girl, why lie? I? Girl, why lie? I?